Yes, I am fully aware that I look like a small child trying on her mother's makeup. Woo! Uh, so I am here to do day four of the biannual Bibliothon, and that challenge is the TV ta challenge. Um, I took inspiration from one of my favourite television shows, Don't Tell the Bride. It is ridiculous. We have it in the UK. I don't think they have it in America, but I know they have it in a lot of European countries. Basically, couples that can't afford a wedding on their own uh, will go on the show. They'll be given a couple thousand quid. The groom and bride are separated for three weeks while the groom plans the entire wedding and the bride has absolutely no say on what happens during her special day. It is absolutely hilarious. I am doing it from Clary's point of view for her wedding with Jay's and I really hope you enjoy. It's gonna be really hard saying goodbye to Jay's. We haven't been apart since, well since he turned evil and went to live with my brother. Am I worried about Alec and Jace? No, Alec's very sensible and I'm sure they won't do any harm. Although ever since he was with Magnus, Alec has been increasingly interested in glitter. I hope Jace doesn't get any ideas from the ceremony. I think the most important thing for me is that all my family and friends are at the wedding. Well, except the dead and evil ones, of course. Bride-to-be Clarissa and chief bridesmaid Isabel are off to see Clary's dream location. Oh Izzy, isn't it just lovely? Wouldn't you love to get married here too? Mm, I can so see you two here. Such a cute couple. Oh, I really hope Jace picks something like this. Do you think he will? Jace? No. Oh, oh, by the angel, no. I am a little bit concerned that Clary has her hopes set just a little bit high. Um, I've had a quick look at some of Jace's plans and they are terrible. She is going to be incredibly disappointed, but isn't him just being there enough? It's the day Clary finally gets to see the dress she'll be wearing on her big day. I have to say I am a tiny bit disappointed. I was hoping to go to a boutique with my mum and Simon and Izzy, but he, Jace appears to have ordered it online. Oh, he learned an online shop for me. How sweet. I cannot wait to see this. Oh, he left a note, the sweet thing. To the future Mrs. Clarissa Harrendale. I really wish he'd kept his name as Lightwood.